hospital has changed since I was there, since I worked there. The area has changed so much. I didn't realize all the good that the hospital's doing for the community now until um, this past year um, when I went to um, a luncheon at the hospital and went on a tour. I, mean, I was just amazed how they're giving back to the people in that area, in that community who need so much. And uh, that's what the hospital, big part of the hospital is now, is now. Not just the patients in the hospital, but the whole area around the hospital. The Sisters of Bon Secours, when they first came here, they went into people's homes, right? There wasn't even a hospital here yet. And their whole goal was to do what today we call population health, which is to just address everything that made a person healthy or made them be able to heal. Bon Secours has always been in my family a favorite place that my mother was born there, all of her siblings. And they lived very close to the hospital, as we did when I was a little girl. And so naturally, I felt like Bon Secours was our family's hospital. So I applied for nursing school there, and I was happy I was accepted, but really didn't know what I was getting into because it was all a new world to me. And what I found to be most unusual, because I came from a Catholic school upbringing, was the fact that the Bon Secours sisters were so down to earth and so open with us. I feel that because of the way the nuns treated all of us, it just felt like a home base right away. And I am a Bon Secours baby, so I will love Bon Secours forever. I, I was born there, I trained there, I worked there for a long time. And my husband used to say, since I had done all of that there, I probably would die there someday. <laughs> but so far, I'm still here. <laughs> at Bon Secours, I uh, think back to when the sisters first came over here from Paris. The sisters have always been extremely good to me. I'm telling you, whatever happened in my life, they were always there for me to help me get through it. And um, I can always remember when my husband died, how they came to the funeral home, how they uh, came to the burial, and it was just, I always just felt so close to them, and it made me feel so good that they cared. I recall something from when I was a little girl, and we lived near the hospital on Pulaski Street, and a sister Malachi, who was a home would do home visits. I don't know why she came to our house. I don't remember. It was maybe after my mother had a baby or something, but she came to visit. And I thought that was really cool that a nun would come out of an institution and come in our house to see us. And so a lot of that made sense to me as I got into nursing school and realized what the mission of the Sisters of Bon Secours is. I carried that into my career because um, for about Eight or nine years, I worked in Bon Secours Home Health Program, and I got to visit patients in that area. And I just loved that part of my career. I moved around a lot, and that's one thing that nursing does for all of us, is give us opportunities to do a lot of different things. But home health nursing, I think, was one of my favorite things. And I, I feel like that, that desire was implanted in me when Sister Malachi came to our house way back when I was a little girl. Caring for others. I've always tried to do that in my life. Not just at the hospital. It wasn't a job, it wasn't a chore. 
was something I love to do for somebody.